Hello children, how are you? I am teacher Elizabeth once again and today we continue our lesson A Great Leader. So get ready with your Bal Bharti textbooks page 17. Now we will see how an incident in Gandhiji's life when he went to England in the year 1931. Let's read the first paragraph and look at the picture on your screen now children. This is when Gandhiji visited the king in England. Once he had gone to England to attend a very important conference. King George of England gave a reception to the participants of the conference at his palace. Now conference is an important meeting and reception is a welcome uh, function or celebration. Okay. People received by the king have to dress up in a certain way. At that time England ruled over India. So you must remember that we were under the British rule children at that time when Gandhiji visited England. People in England wanted to know if Gandhiji would change the style of his dress to see the king. Gandhiji made it very clear that he would be dressed in his usual way even when visiting the king of England. He would wear the dress of the people whom he represented. Gandhiji was not bothered by what style of dress the British approved of so long as the poor people in his country did not have enough clothes to wear. So you see children over here, he is attending the people, he is walking around England, he goes visiting people and there people are wondering what he is going to wear for the conference the next day. And now they were all wondering and here you see children, Gandhiji made it clear that he would dress up in his usual way. Finally, the king had to welcome at his reception this great man dressed in a simple loincloth and a shawl. So you see in the picture your children that the king welcomed them in those same simple clothes. He never felt anything bad or anything good about it. He just welcomed Gandhiji as it is and he was did not show any unhappiness about it. Now the king himself was dressed quite extravagantly. Gandhiji was asked whether he had enough clothes on for meeting with the king. He replied that the king had enough clothes on for both of them. So when later on children the press asked Gandhiji whether he was dressed in a proper way to meet the king, whether his clothes were less or more, what was his opinion about it and Gandhiji gave his very frank opinion and said anyway he said the king had worn enough clothes for both of us. So that was it. Uh, how he dressed up he kept his word he never changed you know that was his commitment millions of poor people in India felt happy that Mahatma Gandhi dressed like them so this showed children his dress his commitment to the people now although Mahatma Gandhi did not use any destructive weapons he had millions of staunch followers staunch means very firm Gandhiji showed all the suppressed people, suppressed means people who are subdued, who are crushed in the world, the new path of Satyagraha, that is uh, Satyagraha means peaceful protest. He is remembered for his greatness not only in India but in all parts of the world. Now you look at that picture children, see how much Gandhiji is respected even today. Okay, his greatness is all over the world not only in India and this greatness lies in his teachings of truth, non-violence and peaceful protest that is Satyagraha. He had millions of staunch followers children even today he has people follow him his his principles his teachings so his teachings are better known in India as Satya that is truth Ahimsa that is non-violence and Satyagraha that is peaceful protest. This new path Gandhiji showed to all the people who were oppressed, who were being oppressed, who were being suppressed, who were being subdued by other uh, stronger countries. So Gandhiji showed them this path of peaceful protest where, wherein you can you can show your protest to the government, you can show your, that you are unhappy, you can show that you don't like something through peaceful protest non-cooperation you don't cooperate with the government but you do it peacefully you sit down for dharnas and all that but you fast but it is all peaceful people sit 
singing bhajans and all children so that was the new part that he showed people okay now i have put up some synonyms for you children we end the lesson there so the difficult words are there some like conference is a meeting or discussion reception is a celebration or a function approved means accepted or supported extravagantly means excessively or lavishly suppressed means subdued or conquered staunch means loyal or firm now i have also an activity sheet for you children based on your textbook these are fill in the blanks and the words are there importance satyagraha suppressed weapons dress and odisha the first one gandhi ji won the war of india's independence without using any weapons second one gandhi ji gave a lot of importance to truth simplicity and non violence third in odisha women were not seen at public meetings or lectures fourth in england gandhi ji wore the dress of the people he represented and the last one gandhi ji showed all the suppressed people in the world the new path of satyagraha now the next exercise there is synonyms and i have jumbled up the answers so lecture means speech weapons armaments fashionable modern suppressed subdued approved accepted okay children so that is your uh, lesson for today and let's meet up now in our next session children the th- last part of this uh, lesson we i will be doing a small test with you and we will also be speaking about tilak and uh, savitri bai phule okay so stay safe and god bless you children thank you and goodbye see you soon